All right, in today's unboxing, we're gonna be taking a look at a wild shoe that pretty much there's no real information out there. But if you bear with me, I pulled together a bunch of information through my research. So let's go ahead and talk about the Jordan Airship Realtree Camos. All right, first thing we're gonna get into is the box. You pretty much have cardboard brown all around with high-res orange for the Nike and the swoosh here all around as well. The size tag reads Jordan Airship PESP Multicolor Oil Green. This is my personal size 12 that I got from the corporate website. On some of the websites out there, it actually lists military brown as being part of the color blocking, but for whatever reason, it's not here on the tag. Now, when you go ahead and open the lid, you are met with this graphic that has an eagle holding a wrench and hammer with Air Jordan written over top of it but we'll come back to this here in a little bit let me go ahead and set that down now you also have the typical airship booklet that's right there under the lid and if you've ever gotten a pair of airships you know that this booklet here just talks about the construction and, and how they were built and for those of you who don't know the airships are known as the ones before the ones because before michael jordan was actually wearing the jordan ones he was wearing the airships but here we have the sneaker itself the real tree jordan airship pe's and the first thing i gotta say is this woodsman camo is crazy i mean it is wow it's it's pretty crazy to look at in hand the fact that it's all over the shoe these are definitely gonna pop out on the street there when you end up wearing them but let's go ahead and look at some of the details so here around the collar you have that brown i was talking about and there is some transition there so i believe this is like a, a suede material and the swoosh itself while it's also brown this is actually a premium feeling kind of leather the camo material here is actually a canvas material all around the sneakers themselves while you do get this extra set of white laces they come pre-laced with brown laces there and then on the inside of the sock liner and behind the tongue you have that brown color as well and then down here on the insole foot pad you have the same eagle holding the wrench and hammer there as well and on the back of the shoe it does say nike air there in brown but take a look at that button i'll post the picture there so you'll be able to read that a lot more clear but it says blood and sweat on it and we're gonna go ahead and tie a bunch of this stuff in. Nothing too different here about the right shoe, but I will say this here on the outside heel of the right shoe, if you look very closely, you'll see those uh, deer antlers there and it says real tree. Maybe a little hard to read, very small on the shoe, can be overlooked if you're not really looking at the details of the sneaker but i did say i wanted to take a look at this symbol here which is a match to what is on the underside of the lid all right so this symbol i was doing a lot of research and there's basically no information out there that explains what exactly this is about but i did remember that this shoe is supposed to have some type of significance to the armed forces and military and then it really got me thinking what does that have to do with michael jordan well a couple things one his father was actually in the air force and if you take a look at this patch here this patch looks awfully similar to what is here on the bottom of the box lid now take a look it does have the eagle in here does have a wrench in one claw and it's a bomb in the other now that's not a direct match to what you have here but maybe nike just didn't get the rights to use it but this says here on the bottom aircraft maintainers well guess what michael jordan's father was a mechanic in the air force so now i'm like okay i think i'm getting somewhere with this and if you read there it does say blood and sweat on this patch as well and on the back of the shoe that button also reads blood and sweats so let me go ahead and also add in the fact that this year in 2023 marks 30 years since michael jordan's father was actually shot and killed during a robbery officially died back in july of 1993 so okay now i'm seeing the correlation here and there's no other information to disprove what it is i'm thinking and where i'm going with this theory so let me go ahead and move on now we do have this oil green here 
on the insole foot pad and we do have this brown now remember i said that some of the websites out there mentioned the fact that this is actually called military brown where if you look at this green and this brown this looks awfully similar to the fatigue colors that the army uses well doing some more research guess what michael jordan is actually an honorary sworn in member of the army national guard go ahead and look it up it happened back in 2010 and now you're like all right well what about this camo that's on here this real tree camo well michael jordan is from north carolina and upon doing some more research apparently on occasion he did go out hunting now there's a lot of rural areas there in north carolina and if you live in the state been in the state know anything about it then you know hunting is something that happens there in the state of north carolina and this is pretty much the camouflage as i stated earlier that hunters will go ahead and wear now i could be completely wrong in everything it is i just talked to you about but if you have information to disprove what it is i'm saying please let us know there in the comments i want to know what the tie-ins are with this eagle symbol here and you know the fact that these colors and all that because you know a lot of times jordan brand they, they put out sneakers and you know the the information that's there as far as what the significance of the shoe is it's super hard to find but someone out there really knows so until someone tells me otherwise the information that i've researched is what it is i'm going with and putting out there for you guys smash that like button if you are liking this video and if you are new to the channel welcome hit that subscriber button so you can be notified every time i drop one of these videos this is lewis other way of kicks channel reminding you to be true stay in the moment and don't forget every day is a great day to wear your kicks